Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com and this is a quick video tour of our exclusive W5T day trading add-on suite for the Think or Swim platform. This is a standalone add-on suite to complement our Elliott Wave Indicator suite and specifically designed to day trade futures, forex and stocks. The exclusive tools we have in our day trading add-on suite are a small group of key levels that price can often test and we find very sticky in addition to the built-in pivots that we have on Think or Swim. So these are yesterday's high, yesterday's close, and if we go down a little bit here, we'll see yesterday's low. We also have the open of today and our special estimated move low and special estimated move high. So these help to frame the trading day for you very well with some key levels there. The next tool is our exclusive W5T EMA cloud. So this is the cloud you can see running through this chart here. This is our W5T EMA cloud. It's a dynamic support and resistance level based on a moving average and plotted as a cloud. So when you combine this dynamic support and resistance level with our Elliott Wave Fibonacci pullback zones, we find very strong support and resistance levels. As you can see here on this Wave 4 pullback, this is the five minute chart for RTY. The Wave 4's pulled back into the green zone and found resistance in our dynamic support and resistance zone there. So really, really strong probability there that's going to go on and it did okay so then we have down in the middle sub chart here we have our MTF multiple time frame dot cloud so each row indicates where the price action is in respect of our W5T EMA cloud for each time frame so instead of having lots of charts open with all of our clouds on this tells you where it is um, on different time frames uh, and these are actually able to uh, you're able to move those and change those time frames I've got these set the top one is set for the current time frame that you're on so this is the five minute then I've got the 15 then I've got the 30 then I've got the hourly and then our key anchor time frame is the daily and this sets the the theme for the trade we only trade in the same direction as our anchor trend as you can see with RTY at the moment our anchor trend is red so we're only looking for bearish trades then at the top we have signaling symbols so you can see the squares at the moment you can see a triangle where the cursor is here as well so these are um, signaling symbols in an uptrend the daily time frame is above its cloud and green and when the top three rows are in sync with the daily trend you can see a green triangle and in this case our anchor trend is red so you'll see a red triangle there so the top three rows here on the dots are red so we'll see the triangle that's a signaling triangle that we've got a potential trade on here for short um, and that's discussed more in the boot camp that comes with this add-on suite and then when we get four which is the the best scenario here we get the red square here so another multiple time frame indicator we've added is the overlaying and a higher time frame stochastic at the on the false breakout stochastic included with the first Elliott Wave indicator suite. So this is down at the bottom here, at the bottom of the chart. So the core indicator identified with the cyan and red stochastics here. This is unchanged. Okay, this is the standard and with our yellow false breakout at the bottom. Now, in the multiple time frame version, we've overlaid an orange and gray percentage K percentage D line and used a magenta false breakout, as you can see at the bottom here, along with magenta arrows. As you can see these arrows here at the top and the bottom. So we found that the stronger momentum signals tend to come when both time frames are set to work with each other in the same direction. Some of the trade setups we will talk about in the training boot camp consider how these two time frame uh, stochastics interact. So finally, we have three extremely strong day trading strategies using our exclusive add-on suite. First is the original fifth wave trade. 
So in this instance here, we had the wave four pullback. We had some more uh, support with our dot with our cloud here in the green zone, and then we traded the fifth wave and it hit the target. We had the 535, but also we had the pullback against both the multiple time frame false bar and our normal time frame and it crossed over uh, in the overbought zone here as you can see on the dot cloud it pulled back slightly we got green magenta uh, sorry the cyan as the the five and it pulled into the cloud and then it came back and then we got the signal here on the first square to go short and then we got our down arrow as normal so this here just before our 6-4 moving average high which is our entry position we got the signal to go short so see how we build up for really stronger um, fifth wave trades and we eliminate those lower probability moves then we have uh, our we can now trade the third wave of an Elliott wave sequence with our second day trading strategy and, and that will be discussed more in our uh, training boot camp that comes free with this day trading add-on suite and thirdly our strategy uh, the, the last strategy revolves around this MTF dot cloud here in, in the middle there and we look for pullbacks against the main trend uh, so we're looking for with day trading measured pullbacks and we can use and we've got a strategy that works very well that combines all the other tools for, for measured pullbacks during there. So this is a great add-on suite for Think or Swim uh, from TradeTheFifth.com.